Hello everyone, welcome out to my home course, Mazingo Lake, and 18 mile an hour winds, beautiful October day, so I had to factor in a couple clubs, but I haven't gotten to play a whole lot of long course, and I'm playing the front men's tees today, but on our channel we do a lot with the youth course and shorter yardages, so it was just kind of nice to, even though I hit a nice little hosel fade here, uh, it was really nice to get out and play a full length course. So I'd start with a beautiful drive, and of course the El Hosel, then a pitch up onto the green to kind of get back in rhythm. Nice, decently long right to left downhill putt. Not bad touch for not having done any warm up putts. And was able to knock down a mid ranger there to secure the bogey, which I'm not really unhappy with. Tight tee shot here, went with a six iron, five iron, and uh, Found the fairway, it's a pretty short hole, so you really just want to find fairway here and have yourself a shot in. Got a little quick here with the wedge, as you'll see, and hit a little thin and yanked it off course a little bit, just trying to help it out and definitely did not do me any favors. And uh, really tough predicament. My son Silas filming there was obviously expecting a little more from me, but it didn't happen. And trying to get up and down here to save another bogey and able to do it. So started out rolling the ball pretty straight. So happy with that. We move on to hole three, par five. And there's no room right, but there is a lot of room left, thankfully, and that wind took it and started a little out on the toe. And so we found ourselves in four fairway. Had a mile in and so decided to work back to the other fairway and came up a little short and to the right, but really great strike. And then we hit this one a little fat, kind of tentative on my commitment there. And so we're gonna pitch up, tried to kind of run it up with a pitching wedge, just left it a little bit short. And so I've got a really long putt for par. Put a good roll on it. And yes, sir, that's a par. So we're at two over through three, trying to claw back a little bit toward par. Tee shot, extremely downwind, 350 yards. Played a really strong draw here, rolled out really well and had about 30 yards to the, to the flag stick here. Hit a little 58, chopped it up there to a few feet, hoping for a birdie. Didn't quite read enough break on this one, so had to settle for a par, which again, nice to be on the par train. And now we go to par three. A little bit of a crosswind right to left and sitting at 160 yards to flag. Wind hurting a little bit. I was able to hit it thin, but got away with it. We stuck it on the green. Pretty excited about that. This one I knew pretty quick, yep, wasn't online. And so we're going to clean this one up for par, make three pars in a row after that big putt on hole three. And so we turn to the par five sixth. This was my best drive of the day. Got it right off the middle of the face. Cleared the bunker on the right since we're playing the forward tees. Even into the wind, one of the best drives I've ever hit on this hole. Leaving us 200 yards in. into the wind, and yeah, hit it right through that. Came out really hot from the from the rough, and so I found myself to the right of the hole. Short-sided, no problem. Got a nice little kick and bounce and run up. And so have this left for a birdie, but... And hey, we've got a red number on the scorecard. So just one over through six. My low score on 18 holes is 83, and uh, so still searching for that 80. And I'm telling the camera right there that we just went in the water because this is stroke hole number one, very tight tee shot, so I had to take a drop. The pin, because the camera's shaking, the pin's over on the left side, you might be able to see it just barely. And hit it pretty clean there. Um, third stroke, as we had to drop two, we hit three, and uh, just went off the back. Tried to run this one up, kind of hand forward press and roll out, but it just released a lot more than I wanted it to. So I had a lot left 
for bogey and gonna have to settle for a double tap in here. Par three over water. Really fun place to find a lot of golf balls when you have the chance. And hit a good one. Took a 50 degree wedge, played, rode the wind, and found herself on the dance floor. Figured it was downhill, but didn't allow for the wind pushing back on it. We left it short, so I wasn't going to do that again. And had a little more gas than I wanted. Set a little knee knocker here for par. Thankfully rolled it in for bogey. So four over going to last tee, 340 yards to the pin. Front tees downwind and got it out on the toe a little bit. So understand why some of these power drivers line up on the heel at a dress. Silas here trying to do some extra good camera work because we're pin high, but we're just not big enough yet. He's only eight, so have this putt for birdie to stay under 40 here. Pretty good line, but just did not have the pace. So we're going to settle for a four over 40, which is still a really nice score for me considering how much I play. And there's the scorecard, 16 putts. You saw the stats. Here's some great videos you could check out on our channel. Would love for you to hang around and watch some of that. And here's beautiful Mazingo Lake golf course. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time.